Noah, nice to see you again. So who exactly is this Georgie guy we've been searching for all these years? I mean, you've told us some things here and there, but never the full story. Why have you ordered myself and the other men to go after him, sir? You're the youngest member on the squad, but it's a story I don't like to get into that much. One that haunts me every day of my life. I close my eyes and I see him. I open my eyes and I see him. I turn over in bed and there he is. With all due respect, did you two used to... Did you used to be gay? No! What a stupid thing to say! I was just asking, because of the way you described it. it sounded like, you know, you used to have a thing. Don't ever ask me anything like that again. You know how we feel about those kinds of people. And they ain't right. They don't understand that they're a disease to this world. One of my buddies in Desert Storm told me them gays created AIDS. If it were up to me, they'd all be wiped out in one huge genocide. Much like the wretched people killed in the Hiroshima explosion. They got what they deserved. If I was there, I would have hit the button and have been proud. You sound a lot like the Nazis right now. Ah. Uh, the Nazis. Such a misunderstood group of people. How can you say that? So about Georgie. George. He was the one in the news story months ago, right? Noah. Get to bed. No, Dad. Now that I know the truth, I've got I it. I said go to your bedroom! Wait! Don't turn around. But, Dad... I'm sad to say this, but you know too much. I should have kept my mouth shut. It was you. George didn't kill mom. Am I right? <laughs>